actually lining up to see for the first time this morning the new generation of, of Sega games and they are going to be on your television screen they're going to be on your computers sony and nintendo are coming on soon but this is the first look at an amazing new site jeff gersman of videogames.com is here and sega product analyst dennis lee is here to talk about the, the video game revolution hello everyone i'm back i'm glad that you're back too i'm glad that everyone's back i'm do it continue continue our journeys in Svartalfheim. Uh, it's also time to light a candle. And it's time to get the text back up there. Get that... Get that dying counter. And... <clears throat> go. Candle can't replace with subs cam? No, no, no. That is... That is the candle. That's the scent. The ghastly wick, though. I gotta trim that up. I'll be right back. Actually, here. Maybe something interesting will happen. Here we go. Uh, is that a locally made thing or something you got online? It is online. It's from a company called Wick and Skull. This is the uh, the hang time hang time branded scent. It's listed as smelling like vacation, and it smells delightful. Ah, love how you've done a slow burn of this. Now I finished it, so now I can catch the streams. Okay, good. I, I feel like now is pretty safe. I did kind of want to wait until most people had kind of had their, their run with it, stream it. So that they can haughtily tell me everything I'm doing wrong. Okay. Oh no, I don't have an affiliate code or anything. But I imagine if they sell, it helps out hang time. I imagine they would appreciate that. Yeah, would definitely don't spoil anything. I would appreciate that. Oh, is that a new tiki head? You noticed. I was curious if anyone was going to notice. It is new one. It's newer and bigger. Yeah. Yeah, I think what's going to end up happening is this will be our, yeah, boulder. It is a little more streamery. It's like more colorful and whimsical. But yeah, I think this will be our new stream friend, and then the existing Moai head will go into Steph's home office, which she's going to set up. Oh, they're multiplying. That's just how it. That's just how it is here. This is a place where Easter Island heads, Moai heads, collect. I like to. Uh, they like to gather. They feel safe here. Everyone looks more like you? You think so? Yeah, I can see it. I can see it. That wasn't uh, a motivating factor, but it's a welcome one. Ooh. Look at this big old place with all of its grapples and platforms and things. Yeah, being able to like go up and down quickly with uh with navigation nodes that are pretty easy to see i guess has has opened them up to making these uh multi-platform areas a lot better than just being like wide and flat i want to go down here i think that just goes wait no no that's towards the objective though 
Hmm. You played any of the other God of War games? Yes, I've played them all. I know it. I take that back. I haven't played the uh, I didn't play the PSP one. Or was there a Vita one? Whatever. I didn't play Ascension. It was like that side game. And then I didn't play Chains of Olympus. I think it was the mobile one. Probably shouldn't do this. I'll just go towards the objective. Whatever. Chains of Olympus is okay. Yeah, I don't know. I after playing God of War three, I was I was pretty fundamentally not a huge fan of God of War. I was like, it was okay, I guess. I don't know. God of War three is is one of the few games that I disliked for how tasteless it was. Um, but twenty eighteen brought it all back for me. So I don't know. After three, I just had very little interest in. That one has to be it. Really, like two, I was just like, uh, all right. What a weird series to like, I guess if, if people are willing to buy it. But. I think I see a crank over here. Oh, there were two on PSP. Another mental exercise. Jeez. What I really went for it, huh? Life fighting such as Tear. They have any desire to prove themselves. The proof leaves a wake of destruction. But if the wake of destruction is a bunch of bad guys, why does that matter? You're strong, and you did the right thing. War does not measure the strength of a man. I hope one day you understand. Hmm. Saw a thread on Twitter where people were ranking all the games, and people had 2018 and this at the bottom? That's got to be some nostalgia. Okay, it looks like this machine is dropping ore into the water drop. Oh, we got puzzles now. Ah! Ah! What? We don't get any ore. Oh wait, you have to keep doing it. Never mind. What do I want? Why do I want ore though? Ugh. go. Mm, yes, I've done it. Okay. Oh, wait. It's gotta be it. Yes. It does have to be it, doesn't it? Of course it does. That's why I did it. Yes. Yes, indeed, yes. Wait, what is this do? Does the ore sit there? If it's... I'm an original series hater. I thought two and Chains of Olympus were good, but not so much as the rest of them. Okay, so that keeps blocking. Uh, yeah, I, I liked one. I thought one was really clever and a really fun spectacle action game. I thought it had enough of a soul to justify its like brutality. Um, and then two, two and three were just kind of like two was just kind of like trying. <laughs> just more of the more of that I guess and then three three almost like took pride in being brutal and disgusting so it was it was almost a double down on it was a complete removal of uh of any kind of like intelligent framework oh I heard that there you are Now, if anything, it might have gone too far the other way. 
uh, Ragnarok doesn't really have Come like on, the takedowns aren't super brutal in this door, game. Right? There's not there's not a ton of brutality, which almost does kind of it does kind of match the <laughs> Kratos's um, becoming civilized almost. I'm telegram to be still. <laughs> Yeah, it became a parody of itself with no self-awareness. Yeah, Sam. Yes, I think that's the thing. In the first game, it, it like the cinematic action was fun, and it, it matched the sort of the feeling of a of a Greek story. It's big and epic and violent. I guess God of War three was as well, but yeah, it was no longer like through the lens of the story. That's just what it was. Section of the mine. There are some that I would consider pretty brutal. Okay, maybe I just haven't seen them yet. I've seen a couple. There's been a couple of like, oh damn moments. And I'm still so early in this game. Uh, anything I say about this game is just more speculation. Like trying to extrapolate from a super, super tiny amount of information. You think sequences like this are still because of like PS4? You have time for data to stream in and out. Damn it! Did you hear that, brothers? I don't think we're alone. Ears open. Eyes up. I think they had to keep one-upping themselves, but did it without a sense of irony. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I guess I can... Come over here. There's a passage leading out. I should cut God of War 3 a little more credit, because it was also kind of... Be it was trying to be a system seller. That was the context of the game. PS3 exclusive and all that. So when you have a game that is about spectacle and now it's appearing on a next generation console. Do my words irritate you? It's fine. I get it. Fine. Brothers. Wait, is that light up ahead there? I really, really wish I had started a hey, brother counter. This might be it. I feel like it's too late now. It just wouldn't be that academic. They must be trying to keep something in. You don't lock a door like that to secure the spare bed clothes. I see what we must do. Okay, so there's some good stuff with enemies I haven't even encountered yet. Great, I look forward to it. Ooh. Bifrost attacks. Ein Harriar can inflict Bifrost on the health bar. Bifrost heals over time, but follow up pits can detonate it for extra damage. Okay, so you, you like intentionally take hits? You take certain hits, but try to miss others so you don't detonate your health? Ein Harriar, Asgard's finest, a warrior of Midgard, wants nothing more than to fall in battle. It would ensure passage to Valhalla, a promised land where the honorable and wretched alike are sent. There, Odin selects the best and give them another chance to die for him, thus creating the Ein Harriar. It's diabolically genius if one would like to view it that way. Instill enough devotion within a bloodthirsty group of undead killers, and you guarantee yourself on your endless supply of fodder for your war. Monster Hunter Blast mechanic. Huh. Maybe it's... I guess it converts a chunk of your existing health into Bifrost damage. Instead of... Like, it doesn't... It doesn't make you recover health, does it? Maybe I miss... Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, you don't want that. Shit. Okay. Damn it. Oh, he bopped me. He bopped me. I got bopped. Okay, so you lose health, and then there's another chunk of stacked damage that 
you can recover from. Okay. That's interesting. I like that. Oh, oh, you take that through Dan, through a uh, shield. Okay. Oh, shit. They don't want us in there. This has to be it. Back to it then. Bifrost is a clever idea. Yeah, I'm curious when it's going to. I'm curious. I'm curious how it'll it'll change the texture of fights. I'm not quite sure how it it's going to change my decision making outside of like, just don't get hit. Can I smash this? Why does it look so rickety? Is it? There's a button you hold to charge up the axe. And I remember not using it and thinking I should use it. Like you, you just hold it and charge. Yeah, triangle. Okay. Nice man. Welcome back. Okay. And then that's yeah, it's the twirl button for that. Okay. I'm trying to remind myself of the of the mechanics. Make sure I use some of the all the. Make sure I use all the tools in the kit. Is this Odin? What game do you play with me now? We're not Jared Leto. Okay. We're the good guys. They should have played up his appearance. <sighs> Even kind of looks like Leto's character from Blade Runner. Rather, let me try. Tier. Tier. Look, you know me, don't you? You... You killed Mimir. No, 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 no. Yeah, we, we brought him right back. You, stay away from me, you monsters. Stop. We need him. Why? Interesting characterization. Can't say I was expecting that. I like it though. I guess he's been there for a while. Scream? Scream chicken? Yeah. 
Shit! Oh crap! Just too bad. He didn't die, did he? Careful, brother! You're covered in bifrost. There goes that, huh? Ah, fuck. Why they attack with the Man, the top half of him kind of flopped off the porch. Some of the ragdolling in this game has been just delightful. Brother. Oh, is there a somebody? Somebody mentioned that there was like an ultra extended option when it comes to them hinting you about stuff. Where would that be? Okay. Uh, is it here? Extended plus. There we go. That's what I was looking for. I don't know why I thought it would be at the bottom. What? Shit. Shit. Ah. It's just for puzzle mechanics, not their backseating. I mean, that's... At least it's something. Do you mean, like, the navigational stuff? Where they're always, like, calling certain things out to you? Okay, so it, if you block it, it does not do a base amount of damage. But I guess if it stacks up to your whole life bar, it probably kills you. Okay. Okay, and then that actually reduces your Bifrost. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, and you have to hit a bell in a certain time frame to unlock a Nornir chest. There isn't a setting at all where they're talking in regards to puzzles. Oh, okay. They call out the locations of them and stuff? Atreus! This way! Cut it off! I'm about to get knocked around with my channel. You careful, brother! You're covered in life loss! Oh, what? Huh. So I get that's weird, because the, the, the point of this shield was that it could block those. But I guess if I get hit twice while I'm in block stun for a yellow attack, then I get staggered. So it's not that it can block them, it's just that it can block one of them. Like when I'm in block stun after soaking a sh like a shield bash attack. If I get any other kind of hit, then I get shield bash. So it's like it's like armor for one hit, not total armor. Careful, brother! You're covered in Oh, 
Oh, I, I accidentally used my fake. I see. Use my combo ability or whatever. Oh, shit. Okay, no, you can take five frost damage. Damn it, dude. Uh. Right side, brother. Behind you, brother. That's the last of them. Let's find your son. <laughs> Chunky. Yeah, the 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 combat is meaty. I take I kind of think that as an intersection of like the somewhat slow pace of the combos. Like Kratos's pace is pretty slow. The enemies are quite fast. But if you get enemies and hits done, there's a very like kind of like deliberate rhythm to the attacks with the axe anyway. The blades are a little more manic, but there's that, and then just like the sound effects are so so good. Just leave me alone. Tear, listen, I swear we're not here to hurt you. We're just trying to get, get you away out. From me, please. Take you somewhere safe, I away from you. Odin. Show mercy. This is my father. We help people. I don't no, belong you don't. out here. Please, it's worse when he's angry. Father. Are you not a soldier? Are you not a leader of men? Master yourself! My son brought us to this place. For you! Look at him! You. Why? You don't know me. I know what you stood for. You helped the giants. We're returning the favor. We? We are leaving. Are you coming with us? Here. Your statue in the lake. You had a spear. I thought you needed a weapon. Walking stick? No. Oh. A kind thought, but no. Thank you, no. But... Okay. <laughs> Wanted to see Tear smash things. I, uh... I, I ran because I don't always know what's real. Sometimes there's a... There's no shame in that, brother. We live in strange times. Everyone hears him talk. Yes, yeah, Sam, the, the camera framing stuff. We must return home. It was still cool. My brain is like, well, they did that already. But I'm also like, it was still really cool, though. Like, it was still a sick shot. If they do it a third time, that might be like, all right, all right. You're going to have to work pretty hard to do that again. But. A wind blowing from over here. Maybe there's an exit nearby. Are there names by yeah. which I should call you? I'm a trade. Lock my arm rest in optimum and controller holding Spartan. position. Kratos. How does the son of a Spartan <laughs> speak for the Yotnar? My mother was the last giant in Midgard. Laufey? Laufey. I remember that name. She tried to help people, too. He's in the light of Alpha now. You have my sympathies. <laughs> Always treasure. Yes. <laughs> Game is so sick, you guys. It just plays so good. So smooth. Like a nice whiskey. So smooth. Got texture and body. Notes of vanilla. Everyone seems to be pretty, uh, Are you okay? pretty impressed with the, the story density of the game, too. 
There's a lot of stuff that happens, and a lot of it is interesting. Please. I'm excited, I'll let my brain chew it over. It's the least I can do. Whoa. Why is this game not on PC? It it probably will be eventually. But in the meantime, Sony stands to gain by releasing it on their platforms first. Free me. Well, Ragnarok is coming. I hope you knew that. We thought you'd want to help. You freed me only to start a war? No! You are the um, god of war. Sotia, it's good to see you in the flesh again. Mimir, what's become of you? Following in your footsteps. Betrayal, indefinite imprisonment, execrable torture at the hands of the Old Father. You didn't deserve such treatment. Did you? I will say my view was a touch better than yours. We found him at the top of a mountain with tree roots wrapped all around him. The only way to free him was to... Well, that. Highly pleasant. For all parties involved. Ah. You okay? The light. It's... It's been so long. There's an outcropping just ahead. The shade really? Will be easier on your eyes. Huh? Hold on. Grateful to catch the stream, a 6k weight dropped on my toe, and I'm currently draped, draped with a blanket, anxiously building up that I'm not gonna, I'm not going into work call for tomorrow. But this is alleviating that for now. Ugh. Well, you get the day off, you know. You just got to make one uncomfortable call. You said Ragnarok is coming. Mixed news, though. Which means it's almost like it's like you're sick and you're like, ugh, I feel like shit. I'm sick, but at the, in the back area, you're like, I get to stay fucking home. I have permission to take like a day where I get to do nothing. Alder, so it's Alder like, eh. Odin sent him to track down a giant in Midgard, and then he found Kratos. And... Anyway, I'd promise to take these two to the tallest peak in the realms if they chop off my head and convince Freya to bring it back. Come here. Speak of Alder. I was getting to that. It wasn't all kill this, kill that. Hey, we're back in the wetlands. I once dropped a two pound glass jar of spaghetti sauce on my toe in the grocery store parking lot. He yelled, fuck, in front of a bunch of kids. What I had a, uh, geez, I was installing a like floor AC unit and I was kind of like stretching the little tube and putting the exhaust fan into the window. And the window like that, it was a tube that like clipped into this sliding panel and the panel slid and then was held in place with a screw. <laughs> so I had like picked it up and I thought the screw was tight enough to hold the panel, but it wasn't. So it slid out and then just like a guillotine dropped directly onto my toe. And it was just like this, this really heavy, thick ridged edge plastic that just wham, just bashed my toe. And it was the most blinding pain. I think I felt a couple of things worse than that, but not many. Okay, I've got you. I said a swear. I was like, I was holding a screwdriver. And I was like, oh, I gotta throw it. Gotta throw it now. So I like, I looked around the room and like in a span of like fractions of a second evaluated every direction that I could throw the screwdriver. Uh, and I eventually settled for, there was like a corner that had a pillow in it. So I was like, Rah! and I just threw it at the pillow really hard. And it just kind of bounced off. No big deal, but it helped. It definitely helped. I'm here today because of that executive decision I made. Shit. Come. We must leave before more creatures attack. You should have taken the spear. Defended yourself. No. I have abjured all violence. But you're the god of war. I left that behind long ago. If Odin starts Ragnarok, you really wouldn't fight? Not even if I wished to. Wow, okay. Swerve. Once dropped a roll of toilet paper on my toe. Ooh. Ooh, that's a bad one. Oh, 
surprised you're still uh, healthy enough to be posting on Twitch. Going through an ordeal like that. <laughs> oh, you stepped on nails and had one go through your foot? Ah, oh, I've never done that. I've never punctured a, like, hand or a foot. Before we go any further... I think I've come close. The truth. What is it you want from me? You speak of Ragnarok. Is it a god of war you came to find? Is that the tear you need? Atreus. I... Forgive me. I am grateful for my freedom. But if you want me to follow you to war... Or worse yet, lead you to it... Then kill me, now. My fight is gone. Damage is done. No one's killing you, brother. Better that than to live to see Ragnarok. We do not seek war. We just want some answers. I don't know how to help you. It doesn't matter. The Giants trusted you. That's the tier we need. We need you. All right. All I ask is for a good night's rest. And maybe some food. Is, is Tyr going to be like the cool dad? The guards bringing me dinner. I feel like, are we teeing up like cool stepfather? Perhaps now you'd like to finish the story? The sons of Thor attacked us. We killed them. Balder tried to kill Freya. I killed him. But you skipped over how we fought and freed the Valkyries. And that the giants are all gone. And now they called me Loki. And finding the shrines The giants and are gone. When we got to Jotunheim, they were all... Dead. Dead? Do you think Odin... We do not know. I think we're getting out of here not a moment too soon. Whoa, what are those? Reinforcements from Asgard. The Ain Hurriar will want to investigate my disappearance thoroughly. <clears throat> Are they using the sky to travel between realms? Odin's got tricks on his sleeve we haven't dared to consider. They're coming down on neither Valir too. Will the dwarves be okay? The time for such concerns has passed. We must leave. Now. It's kind of... That's interesting. Just sort of invented tension out of nowhere. Oh, there they are. Behind! That's a pretty cool way to, to enter, enter combat. <laughs> Where'd you go? Oh, shit. Careful, brother. You're covered in fly frost. Thanks. <clears throat> yeah, those callouts. Yeah, those are gonna get annoying. Careful, brother. How do you like the way Odin is presented so far? I mean, I've only seen the one scene with him, but I liked it. Okay. I don't have strong opinions one way or the other yet, really. I know some people are, are pretty... don't quite like the depiction of the Norse gods as being American, or their accent just being American. Let's see. I am not certain he will prove as useful to us as Atreus hoped, either as a leader or as a source of information. But perhaps with patience he will recover himself. Most importantly, he seeks neither war nor revenge for the suffering visited upon him. Uh, in this, I am grateful. Yeah, like a mobster. Yggdrasil. It's been too long. I had forgotten. Jacob kind of likened him to a tech CEO. Tear? Somebody who's just kind of running everything. Did you ever hear the giants talk about Loki? I'm sorry. That name doesn't sound familiar. The giants are, were, 
Very private people. Makes sense. Perhaps after a rest. Wow, oh yeah, there's still this little nod notch over here. Can you still hey, just jump here. off? This is the place we use your Unity Stone to reach where you hit the Jotunheim Tower. Oh, yes. So much trouble to get to trying to protect the giants. Did it work? I guess. I'm not sure. Hey, JC, how's it going? A treehouse. Lord Tear, you're really alive. Am I? I wonder. Okay. He's just tired. I promised him some food and a room to rest in. Ah, of course you did. Well, let's see what we can do. Please, come inside. Uh, we'll be right in. <laughs> we will. Oh, I thought he wanted to talk. Oh, okay. So, can we talk? Oh, now we're doing it. Okay. What to do next? There is much to consider. We will speak in the morning. Oh, okay. In the morning. What's it like playing this, knowing a friend was a contributing factor in its development? Hold still! Exactly the same as a friend not being a... <clears throat> not being a contributing factor in its development. I guess it's cool. I mean... It's neat to go from not knowing anyone who's ever made a game to, like, knowing somebody personally who has or has worked on them, but, like, Steph. Steph has worked on many of the games that I've played. So I'm I'm kind of familiar with the feeling, I suppose. Plus, uh, plus games are made by hundreds and hundreds of people. So it's unlikely that any one person's contribution will be so outstanding that I will be able to, like, identify it based on personality alone. Oh, much better. Thank you. See? Sleep tight, dear. Aw. I'm going to turn in. Don't be sleepy. So, Tyr, sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting you settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey, come see what I got for you. I'm sure we won't be interrupted Have any goings on. And I'll arrange accommodations. I may need time to construct a bed for someone of your scale. Please, don't go to trouble on my account. Too much space would be unsettling. Do you have a broom closet? Yes, but it's where I keep my brooms. That's all I need. To be honest, it's all I can manage. All right. Um, some food then. Oh, nothing much. Perhaps some hardtack. Hardtack. Any sort of humble ship's biscuit will do. I. With a pinch of salt? Well, I'll see what I can find. Hmm. Perhaps I'll be able to sleep tonight. Really sleep. The sleep of a free man without the All Father's eye on me. <laughs> he's just going. Oh, okay, he's done. He's excited to eat an entire box of saltine crackers. You know what? They must be in the pantry. I'll just look quietly. Well, that's no fun. I wanted to look in the pantry too. You got some slag from the homeland, huh? Hand it over. I'll fix you up. <laughs> this will be of use. Such a small amount, like fifty-five hack silver. A whole, ch a whole like chest opening animation for that. Is that? Oh. Uh. Thanks for bringing this. At least here, the Aner Yar can't touch it. Aner Yar? All right. Andrew doesn't want you ruining the organization of his pantry. That makes a lot of sense. I understand. I get grumpy when my cabinets get moved around. Radiant Warden handle? Oh. That's neat. That seems like that would be useful to have in specific encounters. So just in case, 
I'll go ahead and craft it just so I've got it. You can do oh, it causes a bonus stun blast. Okay. Ready when you are. Okay, so I guess this means I have, yeah, 20% damage or finisher damage boost now. Okay, I think I understand. I'll look at this. The, uh, the reflection across the streets get me again. It's so fascinating. Like, this ends up being the most direct... No, or uh, the most direct signification that I have, that time is passing, that the uh, angle of the sun is different. You get beamed in the eyes. Yeah, <laughs> exactly, JC. Ray tracing is up too high. This is actually a pretty neat interface. It takes some getting used to, but boy, is it really fast. To see exactly what you want to see in terms of like making new making new gear or upgrading what you got. So that's what's left of tear, huh? Back where I come from, we'd say he's been through a few things. <laughs> <laughs> so have we all. Well, ain't you philosophical? Deep. That's deep Kratos. I do like him sitting in that that weird chaise, all lanky, all linked out. Uh, what's up, Jordy? Good morning. What are you thinking, brother? I am thinking. Want things to be the way they were. Well, I'd like to climb a tree again. Certain ships have sailed. I just wish Atreus were not so restless. Blue and orange. What I am I drinking? Only for your safety. Dr. I Pepper Zero know. Cream Sugar. But. Holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. Although I just finished the can. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, but I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man broken so completely. His pain is fresh. You expect too much. Aye, perhaps. Pity Freya still wants to kill you. That's an ally we could use. That is not an option. I don't suppose it is. Trouble sleeping. Ah! Shh. You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I have to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. We are. Just wasn't sure you'd want to join me. I'm visiting an old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. She wouldn't really. Oh, look, I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in people by not getting yourself murdered. <gasps> but we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it, though? Oh. Well. I get to be playable. How about I suggest an alternative? Something much less risky, but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Jormungandr? 
Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead. So it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So you know where Frey is? No, no. I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first, and then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? It must be so challenging coming up with a variety of different setting excuses to have characters moving slowly. Gears did it systemically. It was always like the radio conversations, two fingers to the ear, but somehow means you can't run at full speed. But like having a character snooping around under a window that you transition to, so they've got to move quietly. It makes sense. Glad you brought your key of Yggdrasil. I seem to have dashed out without mine. Huh. You got sick of having house guests that fast? What? No. I could just use some fresh air, is all. Well, I hope you like it cold. Should we swing by your cabin first? Will your furry friend be joining us this time? Uh, no. I, I meant to tell you. Fenrir's dead. Oh. I'm very sorry to hear that. As wolves go, he was always very clean. Thanks. I'd offer to give you a hug, but why traumatize either of us further? Okay. Caught a whiff of something awful near the Helheim Tower. Remember how to get there? Yep. Cool. Just past the oarsmen. But that's what makes you think Jormungandr's nearby? I know what I smelled. Okay. Well, a lot's kind of happened, and I need answers. Interesting. The director said he had a spreadsheet that had a row for every single moment and how long it would take, which is how they timed it out. When you say moment, do you mean like load? What moment are you referring? What moments are you referring to? The chest. Not so oh, much. that's cute. Shut up. Aww. Yo, so, what's been going on? You know. So, Father said I cast a spell when Fenrir died, but I don't know what he's talking about. Oh, okay. Accidental magic? That is disquieting. Just all the all the gameplay beats makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. I don't know. This game is this game is phenomenally planned out. I'll fix it later. Everything is so utterly crafted and thought about and examined and tuned to be exactly what they want it to be. A bear, including the slobber. Yeah. I think I can't get up there. I lost control. I can. Frey knows magic better than anyone. He could help me, but not giant magic. Fine. We'll do it your way then, Sin. A huge venomous snake seems much safer. It's venomous. <laughs> yeah, the the level of exactness that studios and producers specifically are are able to get with game production now is it's it's very surprising. <laughs> With the way things sounded like they were going, it sounded like video games would just be this like chaotic black mass of a frenzied labor for another 15 years. But it sounds like just between that, the way that this game is made and just the, de the degree of completeness and, and yeah, an explicit craft. Let's see. Oh, okay. It's just like everything's been thought about, everything considered. Reminds me of uh, the interviews with Yoshi P and his production style of just like it's got soundstone on it too. atomizing every work task so explicitly that you can plan plan out work activities down to the hour. You get hyper efficiency in your production. The fact that that's even I know it like the process requires human tuning, of course, but the fact that the process can be so understood to be so uh, so planned. 
is great. I think it's just phenomenal. <laughs> I think it is a good reminder that there's been a significant amount of time. How'd the arm of tear statue end up here? In like the HD era of games production. I'm on it. Huh. The game production expertise has finally caught up. It ends up having some pacing issues separate from the side questing, but I think the story is exactly what they wanted. Yeah, I'll sit to see see that. I've seen some comments that maybe owing to the volume of content in the game that it's not not every last bit of it is fully consistent in terms of quality. It is soundstone, but the path's still blocked. I don't see any more on this side. Hold on, let me look around. Maybe I need a different angle. Player, look around. Go to the only other spot that had, had a view of something. Oh, did I think ahead? Oh, thanks. So, Tyr's arm. Your father owed Thora blood payment. And, well, he got it. Wow, great story. Anyway, is that likely to happen again? Sudden, uncontrolled, bear rampage? Beats me. Hey, what's up, Spiff? Got my back? They're literally made of filth. I'm not touching- Who said you need to touch them? I like the way you think. Okay, here goes nothing! Patience! <laughs> yup! Pretty cool. Ah. Ouch! You're not bleeding badly, yeah. are you? A little help would be nice. Uh, okay. Right. Trace combat. Yeah. Take Pleasant surprise. Ah, oh, you can do wow, freaking matrix dives. Oh. Not sure he'll recover. You want my help or not? Ah. Uh. Atreus! Boy has been frosted. Melee. Give me a second! Okay. <laughs> Quality craftsmanship! A little help would be nice! Uh, okay. I'll just take this security power rock. Oh my gosh, she throws little hammers. Wow, Sidri, first word. Not sure he'll recover. Shut up. Do you want my help or not? Alright, alright. Oh, fuck! Oh. Yeah, Willie, this is my first time playing as a craze. First time this happened in the game so far. Sacrificing so many objects from your bag of tricks. Well, you clearly need the help. Oh, whatever. Cool. I'm glad Atreus has someone, someone aside from Kratos to talk to. That's nice. Oh, dun, 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 dun. I think the lift switch is broken. 
You can fix it, can't you? Or does your brother have all the talent after all? Depends. Is your father all the muscle? If I say yes, you realize you're confirming Brock has all the talent? <sighs> it's well attuned to play Kratos like? Uh, sort of. He's got a longer and. He's got a longer dash. Both in terms of distance and time. I just need to look his up. melee or his range does tons more damage. Keeps bad things from happening to him. His melee seems to be okay, but it, like he, it's not really the primary instrument. Besides, it seems like he likes me. He's only eaten me once. I had conveniently scrubbed that from my memory. Well, we're here. Ooh, what's that? What's oh, a door? Yeah, he's got that magic bag of holding. Pumpkin, Stein. That reminds me, there's a slice of pumpkin pie in the fridge. Told you he's gone. Well, have you tried calling him? Blowing the horn's the first thing we try. I'm not talking about the horn. Your mute. That's not weird at all. Shh. Is it just me or are there more cutscenes? Like more not even walking and talking, just like camera controlled cutscenes. Whatever, God of War is about spectacle. Yay! Guard server was always pretty cool. Yeah, Jormin Gander, my bad. What's Midgard so? Is that a difference? Oh, that's the one from Final Fantasy IV, or from Final Fantasy VII. Right. And in 14. Got my big snakes mixed up. What is that? Hey, what's up, triple kill? That's all you're gonna say? Well, don't let us keep you up or anything. <laughs> they got burpy talk. Good talk. Ironwood. What do you think it means? It means we should have stayed home. Let's head back. Uh, okay. I think it's a trace is cool. I was curious how much they justify. Justify Jormungandr, Gondor, or if it's just like, remember this character? I guess either way, it's it's Still cool. Going back that way, but I know another path. Can't argue about it. We haven't seen Jormungandr Gondor since Fimble Winter began. I was beginning to think he'd left the Lake of Nine somehow, but Sindri's nose was right. The world serpent woke up when I called, but when I asked him about Loki and what I should do, all he had to say was, Yarnvidir? Not helpful. No idea what Ironwood means, but it was still nice to see him again. Okay. This way. Patience. I'm being patient. I'm being patient. It's it's just hypersensitivity to Looks like frozen. Maybe I can ban ah. service. Ah. I think I'm personally just pretty exhausted of it. Would you just let me do it? 
I do like I do like Kratos's or sorry, I like Atreus's like teen frustration and anger when he's trying to open things or like stroll up to the old Valkyrie Council Circle and work machines and things. Mode. Well, now that I know where she is, yeah. Exactly what I'm gonna do. Fuck. Yeah, it's just as short tempered as Kratos in some ways. Unbearable when he's smug. I think they definitely softened him a lot in terms of his dialogue and his relationship to Kratos. We had no choice. He doesn't really push back at all. Well, I'm not gonna ask her. Besides, they were your arrows. You're absolutely right. That's exactly why I'm recommending we don't do this. Which I I think makes sense, and it's it's like it's it's good writing. Uh, it's good structure. I also think it's probably... He probably reads better to the audience when he's not fighting with Kratos or complaining about things. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that you can see what he pulls out, so you know what the next one's gonna be. Ooh. He just drops it. That's great. Oh, buckle up, this game does some fan service, but I feel it's all pretty well implemented and fun. Yeah, I need to get over myself. <laughs> That's really the answer. I don't know why. I don't know why I've been so sensitive about it. Well, that's quite enough excitement for one day. No way. We're so close. Oh. The thing is, it should be me, right? I like God of War 2018 a lot, so if there are throwbacks to that game, I should be clapping. Why am I not clapping? Part of me is. Maybe this it's like I sign. can't accept. Don't be a baby. A simple I'll clap. Promise not to drop you this. I am the fan, and I was serviced. It should be, yeah. It should be like, what's the problem? I don't know. Okay. Fine. Just step between the realms, then. You know it doesn't work that way. Though sweet vessel, I wish it did. <gasps> See? Was that so bad? I sincerely hope I never have to do it again. If that's what you're asking. That was cute. <sighs> My shop. Well, if I can't stop you, then this is as far as I go. I'm gonna stay and fix this. Suit yourself. One joke that broke the immersion for me when you decapitate the one troll right off the trolley. Definitely a wink and a nod to the audience. Yeah. Yeah, kind of. It's hard to draw the line. I mean, it still makes sense in the game. Like after a whole, even in, even in universe, you know, after a whole game of killing trolls, Especially when you've played it a lot and they're like, you know that their patterns are pretty simple and easy to easy to master. Or then Kratos to basically have adopted the skill levels that he would have after playing through the game. Um, makes sense in universe too. Those are the ones that I like a lot. Where it merges the player's experience with something that also is logical in universe. Oh, neat. Oh, I already... Wait. Purchase. There we go. Sitting there. Silly me.
You sure you want to go in there wearing the very arrow tip that killed her son? I'll hide it under my shirt. And besides, it's a reminder to be better. You need a murder weapon to be a better person? It makes me feel brave, okay? Is that such a bad thing? When it leads you to believe you can convince Freya of anything, yes, it is. I have to try. Did you beat the game already? No, no. It's all my first playthrough. I'm going pretty slow. I feel like that's a bit safer for Twitch. Giving people a chance that may be really concerned about spoilers a week or two to get through the game. On a uh, on a normal human timeline, Wait. the maybe you have a job timeline, maybe you got to go to school timeline. The alpha. Makes sense. I just grinded so hard. Yeah. Are you Was sure it fun? Was a good idea? Yeah. I never actually got to the grind in, in 2018. I got I got right to it, like at the end of the game when what you have to grind out some gear. Here? This is life and death. And this is Ragnarok. We can't just do nothing, and we're out of options. Living! Living is an option! I'll forget the spoilers by the time it's on PC. Uh. Okay. Now which way to the council? As long as I go up and forward, I think I'll get there eventually. Yeah. It'll good. probably be a few years. That's plenty of time to forget. Oosh. Bathroom break. I'll be right back. Back at the Krispy Kreme. Oh. Oh. Okay. All right. <clears throat> there are like stealth takedowns? That'd be an Atreus thing, right? Nope. Hell. Shit. Jumpa! What's up, Bowie Kicks? Gotta say, I'm really enjoying Dark Tide. Me too. Me too. Turns out that game gets way more fun when it's running at a decent frame rate. Oh, it's not help. Shit. Ugh. Yeah, I've had a pretty good time with it. I'm uh, I'm like level five, six. Oh, the grind, grind's already setting in, I guess. But the missions are fun. <laughs> Ah. Oh, wait, what? Dude, they wouldn't let me move. Mashing that X button. It's interesting. You gotta like, gotta be on the move.
takes care of that. Trace is pretty enjoyable to play IMO, but I didn't play. Give me God of War. Played on the difficulty just under it. Don't know why I did though. Oh, well, did you have a good time? I'm having a pretty good time playing on this difficulty. It's it seems a it seems a bit easier than Give Me God of War 2018 so far. But I'm such a baby. I'm such a teeny tiny baby. I know there's a lot more to this game that I don't know about. Wow, need to destroy the Sonic piece first. What's up, Ewido? Good to see you again. All right, I just need to get a different angle on the camera. Okay. Hmm. So far, the list of of craftables seems pretty pretty constrained. I wonder if it's going to be that simple. Man, of like, if father could see me now. He would lose it. A given area has like four chests in it, and inside of those chests are exactly the amount of specific me. resources oh, you need to craft a set of ar a set of armor. Actually, that's a good point. <laughs> I don't know what's more satisfying you listen to me <laughs> what's more satisfying picking up nine bars of old iron and then crafting three pieces of armor or having oh, those crazy. treasure chests just have the three pieces well, of armor where do you it? think i learned it from <sighs> There's no other way to get old iron, it's just the chest. Nice. Nice. So little damage. What the? Huh. Okay. How do you do the like slow mo matrix dodge? Is it just like a last second dodge? Going up. Cool. These little combat arenas are fun. I'm really enjoying them. Why don't you trust her? Why won't you tell me? Yeah. I think crafting is fun when it adds to the game instead of smearing the game out. Interesting. Smearing the game. I think I know what that means. It's like... Inventing trickling rewards for repetitive tasks. 
inventing long-term goals. I guess those always just have a little, little sneeze of uh, hack silver in them. You fell asleep during the stream. Good. That means this is a safe place. You feel comfortable here. This is where you come to recover your life energy. The deer. Is that how they're like telling me where to go? Are you kidding me? Hold on, I wonder if that respawns. Did they really just spawn a deer to tell me to like, hey, go here. That's pretty impressive. Like that's some next level, our, our two IQ players can't remember where to go kind of shit. Oh, it doesn't. Oh shit. That's cool. Uh, that's cool. I mean, if that's if it was like a distraction to like set up a decoy, that's pretty good. Son of a bitch! Aw. Yeah, I got souls. Man, that rolling rock gets everybody the first time, huh? What a fun game Demon Souls was. Out of everything, it was it was definitely out of an era. Oh dear, definitely out of an era where uh, where game developers were trying their hardest to not antagonize players. It was the click over into just like just please play us, please, please, please. We'll give you a leveling meter. We'll give you HD graphics. We'll give you achievement. Like it was definitely a a sea change, I think. But Demon Souls was out here still being cheeky with its players. It would like slap you around for fun. Uh, and that was different. Still, like, I still think about Bayonetta 1. A lot. That game, that game delighted in kicking you in the shins sometimes. It found pleasure in it. It would usually, it would usually apologize. But not always. Yeah, we'll suck your dick, just play our game. I mean, games now. Games now have just gotten really good at sucking dick. That's the difference. Exceptional dick sucking ability in the modern video game industry. Those combos are pretty cool. Guess I'm going the right way. Really wish I had a compass. Yeah, I guess you don't have the on-screen thing because you don't have the item. <laughs> Gluck Gluck 9000. Dude, have you played Gluck Gluck 9000? Incredible. My brain has never felt more stimulated. Never felt less like I'm wasting my time. <laughs> nice, majestic. <laughs> Just sucks you it in. I mean, they make they make battery powered dick suckers now that have like little video game controls on the side. I thought it was for an actual game, but I think it's just the interface for the masturbation device. But yeah, it has like buttons and a D-pad, and I was like, oh, sick! Finally, I've been waiting, training my whole life to excel at this. Time to enter the Olympics. Shit. Huh. Was this like locational? Yeah. 
fun. This music is interesting. Are we starting to hear like Atreus's musical motifs? Oh gosh, that was there the whole time. I think that was just the first one. Game's good. Good video game. Good one. Uh. I'm gonna unexplode that treasure chest. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna open it. I'm gonna get the delicious contents within. I think. From the back. Ah uh, yes. I knew it! Do it! Dopamine released. Thank you, video game. Said it makes sense that they're a bit more lib liberal with Kratos' theme in this game. Draws a sharper line between Atreus and Kratos. Also will make Kratos' combat feel like an event. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's a good point. I I can see it. Guess I'm curious how uh, how much swapping around there is, what the division of time ends up being. I'll be curious to see. Should not have done that. I got this, right? Yeah, I got this. You sure do, Atreus. That was the smartest thing you've done yet. Let me try out the God of War cookbook. That Alana helped edit. Cool. Weird how cookbooks have become the thing. I guess they're just like a gift idea. Seems to be the, seems to be it. It's like a novel gift. For anyone that loves a brand. I imagine book publishers are probably really happy about it. Just need to look out for that big the whole line of uh, sales that they never even had before. Well, oh, that's why that explosive was there. Okay. Maybe there is value in not shooting everything you see as soon as you see it. Yeah, I would like to. I need to get that 14 book. Try to make some of the stuff. If for no other reason, then I'm I'm certain that a Final Fantasy XIV cookbook would have very cute photography of very good-looking food. I should just make more recipes in general. I think I end up my cooking ends up being very like a uh, very utilitarian. This typical dude. Hello down there. Hey. Come to your hey, Rannick, yes. thanks for the yes. sub. I mean, uh, I'm not changing my mind. Ha! You do have doubts. I've got to do it, right? Yeah. Hey! Like you never do? Better than having regrets. I'm not sure I agree with that, but by all means, keep going and you might find those, too. <laughs> Ha! 
Yeah, got his ass. You gotta mess with, you gotta ruffle Sindri's feathers a little bit. Thanks, I feel so much better now. You gotta razz him up. Yep, that's the door. Okay. A lot of these recipes come from traditional dishes that get tweaked. Oh, yeah. It's like, it's like cocktails, you know? It's an old fashioned, it's not a downtown number 40. But you just put a little dash of like... A little dash of coconut or something. But yeah, I wouldn't expect a cookbook. More, much hey, less a Freya. like branded promotional cookbook. I pay an old friend a visit? Uh, wrong with that, right? have nothing but original recipes I mean, in it. Just because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean... Okay, yeah. Should probably avoid mentioning that. Is that Freya? Am I wearing this around my neck? The arrow tip that killed your son? That's a great question. What's going on? Uh... uh I'm so dead. That was weird. Grace kept walking into the wall. I wasn't doing that. Here goes nothing. Yeah, the frozen lightning looks so cool. Oh, man. I'm glad that they give you more vantage points to see it. Old Valkyrie Council from 2018. I still want to go back to 2018. Conquer that game completely. It's pretty smart of them to remind you the significance of that right before this conversation. Freya. You should have stayed with Sindri. Wait! Stop! Okay. Father. Depending on how many Where particle effects happen. Not here! Do let me know if the stream chops up at all. Or like no. breaks. Might get blurry. But it's the chopping up I'm curious about. Shouldn't have come. He took my son. What makes you think I won't do the same? You're better than this. Ooh, had a couple of chops earlier you during combat. Your life on it. Interesting. What do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? You mean to plead for your father, save your breath. His fate is sealed. But you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin, nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? He came to us. Offered peace if we don't move against him. Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Gro's prophecy, you know it depends on an army of giants. The giants wait for war in Jotunheim. No, I've been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. In Jotunheim, you learn the truth. Okay. My mother was the last guardian. Like a little bit of, of Kratos' theme and, in there. And that's not all. The giants have prophecies about me. They know me as Loki. I think maybe I'm supposed to help stop Odin somehow. But since all the giants are dead and you won't fight Odin, then you've already won. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again! I am far from whole! Okay. Okay. 
what we found here. Maybe if you spoke to him. Tears alive? Yeah. We we broke him out of Swartalfarn. Oh, Gweepies. Damn, I'm sorry. The nine realms are closed. I didn't see that as we're all. running. I would have paused. No. I'll try to keep a better eye on that. We opened up the way. We just don't know where to go next. But if we all band together, enough. Enough! Leave this place. Go and do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. I don't know if that went well, but it went. Got my shot, I guess. Our chat wasn't all I hoped for, but it actually could have gone much worse. That's true. At least now I know she doesn't want to kill me. Not really. She seemed interested in to learn about Odin visiting and Tyr being alive, and me being the last giant, especially about the realm travel being unlocked. Really not sure what she's going to do next, but hopefully it won't be using all the information I just gave her to attack us again. Yeah, I really didn't think this through. Now she can go to the... Now she might go to the dwarf place. Fuck all the shit up there. Yeah, that might be a problem. Ooh. Ooh. Accessory. Cool. Okay, I actually have to kind of wrap up God of War there. I want to play this game more. Maybe tomorrow? Wednesday is going to be Skyrim. It's going to be a charity stream with Skyrim. Who knows? Maybe Thursday. Maybe Thanksgiving. But it's almost raid time. It's almost time for Final Fantasy XIV. We've uh, got a raid crew going. We're doing the hardest content in the game. Well... Some of the hardest content in the game. Not the hardest yet. We're not that good yet. But it's been really fun. Uh, whenever I do raids, though, I just put on some chill video game music. Put on a lot of random clips. So there's plenty. Yeah, almost hardest. Maybe like three steps below? Whatever. Anyway. Uh, let's put on some clips. Plenty of uh, plenty of sensory input for the ADHD addled among you. Uh... And I'm excited. I'm excited because we, we wrapped up the last one. So we get to start some new stuff. Uh, so I hope you stick around. It's Cozy Vibes. All right. I'll be right back. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh.